The next feature is about PDF annotations. So you can use the Zodo app for PDF annotations and here you can use different tools. For example, if you want to use the highlighter tool, you can highlight any text in your PDF. You can also use this underline tool if you want to underline some important text. You can also use this pen tool if you want to write on your PDF. You can also add multiple pages to your PDF. You can also delete pages you can also add different signatures i made a separate video about this app you can watch that video the next feature is about text to notes for example you are scrolling through a website and you find some interesting information and you want to save it for example i want to save this text first of all i will start selecting this text so i will select it till here now here you see this option of add to note so i will select this option so the same text will be added to my notes and it will also show you the link so here is the link for this website so if you want to delete this link you can press and hold it like this and then you can delete it from here so the text that you save you can also edit this text as well the next feature is about smart select tool. So if you want to take the screenshot of some specific part of the screen, you can use the smart select tool. For example, I want to take the screenshot of this part. So I will take out this edge panel and then I will scroll to the smart select tool. Now, for example, I will select this rectangle option from here. Now you can select any part of the screen. For example, I want to select this part. You can also resize it. So for example, I will Will resize it from here from top from sides as well and then i can also move it so i will select this part and then i select this done option so here you can see the screenshot has been taken now if you want you can also edit it so you can select this pen option and then if you want to write something you can write and then once you finish with your editing you can just save it using this option and then later you can access it through your gallery